Rare Twitch W. Rare Twitch W. Rare Twitch W. See guys, I said it three times for emphasis. Um, Twitch has decided they're gonna pay their quote unquote employees, sorry, streamers better. You know, because they weren't getting paid enough already. No, I'm just joking. Um, some streamers get paid bad. I guess that's the price that comes with streaming or lack of thereof. I don't really have an opinion on it because I'm not a streamer. I'm a YouTuber. But hey, Twitch is a big company and they spend all their money on um, ego streams anyway, so it doesn't really matter. But yeah, let's get down to the stats. Twitch has dropped the update on payments to streamers. They are expanding the Partner Plus program to give more streamers access to increased net revenue shares on paid and gifted subs. Layman's terms, you get more money on paid and gifted subs. They are eliminating the US 100k cap dollars for 70 to 30 net revenue share recipients. I'm pretty sure this was if you make over 100k, then they cap you and you only make 70 to 30, so 70% of that money goes to you and 30% goes to Twitch to that 100k. So first, you get 100k, 70k of that goes to you, 30k goes to Twitch, and then all above that is a 50-50 split, I'm pretty sure. Let me check real quick. I was right, I'm always right, it is 50-50. If you were a Twitch streamer, that every 100k subsequent, uh, one after the other, would be 50,000. So you'd get 70, then 50, then 50, then 50. Twitch would get 30, then 50, then 50, then 50. A lot of people were mad at this, mainly the wholesome chungus Minecraft YouTubers who are approximately making 2.3 billion quadrillion trillion dollars from every single stream, were quite upset. Looking at you, Tobo. I'm Tobby in it, and today I'm going to be playing Minecraft with Dream. I, I can make that joke because I'm British too. Fortunately, oh, I love Britain. Oh, but yeah, um, they are changing the Prime Gaming subscription payout model to a fixed rate for each country. Now, I'm not sure what this means, but I think it will mean all countries have to pay a fixed amount, which isn't always good because it's much harder to get a hundred dollars for a subscription for like a couple years if you're in venezuela then the united states um the actually applicable example of this is brazil it's harder to get money in brazil doesn't transfer over as easily to the states so you're going to be making less and therefore it will be harder to pay for a subscription which might actually make it difficult for foreign streamers so good or bad or i misinterpreted this completely and it is wrong god damn it my entire thing was wrong Okay, just imagine everything I said, but the opposite, okay? So basically, if you are in Brazil, it's going to be cheaper to pay for a Prime subscription than if you were in the United States, comparable to each other. So it will be easier for people in Brazil to pay for a subscription since it matches the local or average income of that area, which will actually mean it's better, it's more beneficial. So um, yeah, everything I said before when I changed my mind, yeah, just imagine that, but in the reverse. But this isn't it. Twitch is extra generous today. I don't know what happened. Maybe Alinity sent some feet pics over to them. Because, wow, are they making changes. Basically, you needed plus points to get affiliate links. And these affiliate links let you earn money on Twitch. It's quite hard to get these affiliate links before the update. Look at it, you Pyro. Fat L. Someone hated you understandable <laughs> i'm just joking average pyro fan basically by may the 1st 2024 they are adding a new level to the program that allows streamers to receive a 60 40 revenue share split which is considerably worse than the 70 to 30 10 percent but this comes with just 100 plus points if you're a twitch streamer tell me in the comments is that good is that bad YouTube all day long. I love YouTube. I love YouTube. <laughs> I love YouTube. But yeah, Twitch streamers will be able to make money even faster because it's now easier to become an affiliate. This also means Twitch can make more money because running ads on those streams, I don't know, profitable or not. I'm not a business manager. Actually, yes, I am. Crackoon business. I sell crack to the local mind. Don't. I don't. I'm just joking, guys. I'm just joshing with you. Oh, and the existing 70-30 split option has been lowered to just 300 plus points from 350 as well. So it's even easier to earn the sought-after revenue share. Everyone is going to be lusting 
for those cheaper prices. Dare I say hounding. These changes are staggered, I'm pretty sure May and June is when they're happening, so still far away. So all the Twitch streamers can put their mouths away, get up off their knees, because they are not going to be having to glaze for a long while now. But yeah, Twitch W, I guess if you are a Twitch streamer, it's a W for you. You know, maybe I should become a Twitch streamer. Just kidding, YouTube for life. I would never betray YouTube. I love YouTube. I love YouTube. I love YouTube. I love YouTube. Maybe even more than I love you guys. Psych, you're better than YouTube. And you know what? And you know what? I think you should subscribe. And you know what? I think you should subscribe as well. Subscribe for Big PP. Subscribe for Discord Roll. Subscribe for us to hit 1k before the end of June. Thank you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace. But seriously, that was Crackoon Stop with your host Crackoon. Thanks for watching, and I'll see ya. Have a good one. Peace. Goodbye. <laughs>